My name is Nanette DeSillis, and I'm the founding director of Arts Cetera. The kids come in for the first time, you'll often find that they're very shy at first, and I would say that within the first 10 minutes, we've got them, and they're engaged. They may just be sitting and watching everything. They may go over and get their egg shaker. They may go over and get their ball or their paintbrush, but they're engaged. So we definitely hook them. We do. We, we get them in and they're hooked. When we get into our music class, we sit down, we make a circle, we sing a hello song, we welcome everybody in, and we make sure that we make eye contact with every person in the room. We don't want any child to feel left out. Even that shy little observer in the corner who's hiding behind their mom needs to get their hello. Once they have their hello, we take out our instruments, our streamers, we play the music, we dance, we sing, and we have a great time. In an art class, they take their place at the table and the teachers just open up their magic bag of tricks and before you know it, there's colors and there's things flowing and pipe cleaners and clay and they're having a great time and they go home with their product and feel very proud of themselves. You want to bring your child to Art Cetera because if you want your child to have a lot of fun with their family and with their peers, this is the place to be. We create an environment of fun an environment of exploration, of creativity, of allowing children to really be children, and it feeds them more than almost any other thing that they're going to do. You can expect that when your child walks into an art cetera class that they're going to be stimulated and motivated and they're going to have a great time and they're going to want to come back. A lot of children start out as careful observers. We really respect that kids have different learning styles. Remember that kids learn by repetition, by seeing something over and over. Once they make that transition, they'll be there. I can guarantee that. For many children, it's their very first social interaction. They are not used to sitting in a room with other kids, with other moms, and we make sure that they have a good time. Many parents come not knowing what their role is. No, we want the parents to participate, and one of the things I think we've been very successful at is helping parents feel that they can do this. We get them back to their roots of playing music or singing or making art, and they end up having more fun than they thought they would. They thought they were doing it for their kids, and in fact, they're having a great time too. The idea is to create a family experience for them. The thing that makes it so much fun, the music makes it fun. Getting a chance to be a kid yourself is fun. Meeting other moms in the neighborhood is fun. What differentiates us from other licensing programs is that we go out of our way to make every family feel special because they really are special to us because every family is part of how we've grown. All of our teachers are kid magnets. I have teachers that are singers, musicians, actors, but they know how to engage those children and once they get them the kids fall in love with them and once they fall in love they're hooked. Our classes follow the quintessential nap schedules of children. Most of our classes happen in the morning hours and then at the later afternoon hours. What we have found that works very successfully for those mid-afternoon hours are infants classes because those are the babies that are awake at that time but our prime time is morning. Children in our music classes can start anywhere from three, four, five months up to four, and our art classes start from 18 months up to four years. We've also developed a curriculum for four and five year olds, so we're starting to reach into that older group that still needs informal learning, but is looking for a little bit more structure. Whenever I meet new moms in the playgrounds, I always mention Art Cetera. The music is singable and entertaining. It's nice for him to have like simple songs that we can rely on. Everyone needs a little Art Cetera in their life, <laughs> absolutely. Moms and dads, if you really want to do something great for your family, really fun for your children that's going to have a lot of rewards, you'll want to try an art cetera class.